Hello, what's up? I am I'm doing a mall for you. Um, yeah, of course I'm doing a mall for you. Here we've got. I spent 24 hours first on the live challenge. I spent 24 hours in freezing cold ice. The ice prison is officially complete. It's flipping chucking it down and it's... Why are you spending 24 hours in a ice... But in an ice prison... Wait, what? It's not an ice prison, it's an undertitle, it's a sport of life. You're lying to us. I was burning teeth, prick. And also, he's not going to do this for 24 hours. Like, have you seen the views on this video? I mean, 4 million views. Just come on. Freezing! However, it went horribly wrong and I barely made it out alive. He barely made us out alive. You weren't even frozen alive. You, you built an ice house, and you were under it, and something went went horribly wrong for the ten minutes of you recording it. Oh my god, it went horribly wrong. The ten minutes that you were recording this off inside of it, it went horribly wrong. In those ten minutes. That's it. Okay, oh, oh. I know it's fake, but more oh, come on, you have more common sense than not trip over on your on this ice building right outside of your house. Well, your son's inside of it. I just hope that he's okay. Watch. Turn I'm not gonna watch to the end. I'm not gonna go through these. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten midwell ads. I'm gonna watch five minutes at a time. Five minutes, skip five minutes, and then watch the rest. I ordered two thousand dollars of solid ice blocks, and I am gonna build my own ice prison and trap myself inside it for twenty-four hours. This is bad. Two thousand dollars spent on ice blocks. You spent two thousand dollars on bricks of ice. You spent two thousand dollars on water. For the God's sake, those funny, elfed, teeth. For the most extreme twenty-four hour challenge, I will. The most extreme twenty-four hour challenge you ever do. Oh, what about the time that you stayed over, stayed over at your own house for 24 hours and they didn't notice me? What about you spent 24 hours in your girlfriend's house? What about 24 hours somewhere else that was I? Attempt. So as you guys can see, I have 100 blocks of solid ice. So you bothered to count. And as you can see, the whole squad is here creating my very own ice fortress. And Who pays for ice box and puts it in cardboard boxes on the way there? With no double. I am going to be trapped in there with absolutely no escape for 24 hours trying not to freeze alive. This is very dangerous. Do not try this at home. Leave it to the idiot. Yeah, don't, don't, don't try to freeze yourself at home. Totally not, wait, totally not, he's not going to freeze himself. And, uh, that face there. Beautiful. ...like me, willing to put their life on their line for a challenge. And also, if you haven't already subscribed, please go down there and smash that subscribe button. Because I'm probably going to die doing this challenge, and I don't want to die with less than 10 million subscribers. 
He was going to die doing this challenge. Not even a challenge, just staying in a block of ice for 10 minutes and then getting out of it to make sure, like, like oh my god, like one minute each half day. Guys, as you can tell, we've built the fortress four blocks high, but we've run into a problem. As we built the fortress higher and higher, the ice blocks started to slip and fall. And if one of these 27 kilogram ice blocks falls and lands on my head, I think we all know what would happen. So we had the genius idea. The genius idea. So we have the genius idea to put ice blocks onto my uh, onto my um, on top of my head, maybe all the time. And you know, now your brilliant idea, your more brilliant idea about doing this challenge is to put cardboard, cardboard in the thing so it doesn't slip up. 2000 IQ rolls, well done. To add cardboard in between each layer so hopefully they don't fall on my head and kill me. <laughs> So they don't put a dent in the drive. And most importantly, so they don't put a dent in the drive. You're not very respectful, my heart, aren't you? Can't even see. It's clearly see. It's melting while they're doing this. It's really half melted. What are you going to do when it melts when he's sleeping in it? Overnight. Come on, guys! Is this the best you've got? You've been lifting that block for 10 minutes now. Come on, Mini Morgs could have done better. Get a move on. Oh, come on, guys. I'm not paying you to stand around looking at it. Get it on there. Stop moving! You're hardly paying me anything! Are you paying you anything? He's not paying me nothing at all. Anyway, Morgan, you may not be paying us anything, but it'll all be worth it when we see the frozen look on your face. Ladies and gentlemen, the ice prison is officially complete. So now there's no more waiting. It's time for the... So now there's no more waiting. Now we're doing the brilliant idea of killing myself. The challenge to begin. I've got my wetsuit on under my clothes to help keep me dry. Yeah, that's gonna help. What about your Gucci flipping hoodie? That's gonna get wet, isn't it? I've got my bag of supplies kindly prepared by Mum, and I'm. That's gonna wet. This is gonna get wet as well. Isn't it? Ready to go. Let the games begin. Let's. The Hunger Games begin, at least I'm gonna die overnight. We've been in the house for 30 seconds and it's already raining. Ladies and gentlemen, this is it. There is no going back from here. I am officially about to spend 24 hours inside this freezing cold ice house. I've only. Oh, oh, um, but. Um, but, oh, and by the way, um, you said you could put cardboard in between the right eyes, um. No, you didn't, liar. I just entered the house and I can already tell it is a whole lot colder than out there. And the scary part is it's a You are only just telling. It is colder than out there. Yeah, out there it may be raining, but you're inside of an ice fortress. Stupid. It's only gonna get worse and worse as the temperature starts to drop outside. But for now, all I can do is stay here and try and keep as warm as possible. Okay guys, the time is 2pm, which means it's been over an hour since I started the challenge. The ice is starting to melt and I can all- Starting to melt, it was melting an hour ago, you're gonna die. You're not gonna even last five hours. 
I feel it getting colder and colder inside the fortress. However, thankfully, it's still pretty warm outside, so I'm managing to not get too cold yet. But I am starting to get pretty hungry. Mum said she packed me loads of nice snacks inside the bag, so I think you guys know what that means. <laughs> Uh, I think I know what that means. Your mum pranked you. But it was a scripted prank that he knew about. What well, a beautiful face. Look at that Morgan Hudson. Beauty. Beautiful. Food time! Mayonnaise? Cinnamon? Baked beans? Mealworms? She said she was packing me all my favourite snacks! Do I look like I eat mealworms? In fact, I... No, you don't look like you eat mealworms, you look like a worm. Actually, I think I did do that once. Guys, there is no chance I'm eating any of that, so it looks like... I'm going with plan B. Order food on a delivery app and get it delivered to the ice house. This delivery man is going to be very, very confused. Okay, guys, I'm ordering from Subway. I've got a 12-inch turkey and ham sandwich. Mmm. And I... Did, did he have an orgasm in the sandwich? I kindly wrote on the restaurant instructions, please deliver the sandwich to the ice house in the driveway. Yes, you read that correctly. Place order. Okay guys, as you can see, the food is four minutes away. I'm really nervous to see what's gonna happen with the delivery driver. Imagine you're just at work delivering subways around the city to people's houses and then you have to deliver an order to an ice house. I just realised that he's overusing the DOOM. I actually want to see what the subway guys does, so I'm not going to skip five minutes at this point. I'm going to skip five minutes. Hello? Uh, can you order some subway food? Yeah, I've ordered subway, yeah. Could you deliver it uh, to the drive, please? Okay, if you just come in, you'll, you'll see me on the front. Thank you. Yo, guys. <laughs> oh my god! This is it! Hi! Yeah, that, that's that's me, I ordered. Do you like my house? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Thanks so much. Thanks a lot. <laughs> Yo, he did not- Yo, you got your friend in his- I know, you can see these bends, one of those ugly ones. And you got him to, to, to drive down the subway and get to a sandwich. Beautiful, beautiful content. It's amazing. I have a clue what was going on. He was staying 10 feet back from this house. He was not having any of it. To be fair, I think that's probably how I would react. It's not like you deliver to ice houses every day, is it? Anyway, I got my subway. Time to eat. Um, guys, it's... Uh, what, what just happened? What is, what's, why are you always so easy to avoid instead of an ass And I can like, you clearly see behind you that you're about to die. Beautiful. 4 p.m. right now, and I don't know if you can tell, but the sun has gone in and it's starting to get really, really cold. Oh no, not again! The rain's come out! Guys, it wasn't too bad at the start when the sun was out, but now it's flipping chucking it down and it's freezing. And guys, just when you thought it couldn't get any worse, the weather... Oh yeah, I forgot to skip five minutes. So, um... Uh, 13. See if we make it our life. Actually, let's, let's see what happens. Well, like, what happens? I just want to start being terrible. By the way, guys, I skipped a few minutes ahead because it's dangly. Okay. Oh, this is me again. Four large hot chocolates, please. Oh, and can you make sure they're extra hot? Yep, anything else? That's all, thank you. Morgan's gonna love this for real this time. Thank <laughs> you.
Now, guys, at this point, the video took a turn for the worse. At this point, you faked your death. The weather conditions had got so severe that the ice sculpture was now completely dangerous to be around. The 27 kilogram blocks of solid ice were starting to melt, slip, slide, and there was nothing I could do about it. What about your mask fan that you're going to put cardboard in between the blocks? That didn't happen. I was trapped inside my own 24 hour death trap. As Mum and Martin arrived home with the drinks, my biggest fear became a reality. And there was nothing Mum and Martin could do to save me. Can I take it to court? That face was amazing. Where was it? Yeah, yeah. let me look. Let me put, put your head down. Put your head down. Where's it? Just on your head. Yeah. Too much this stuff. You can't see you. You're all real sick. Oh, that's on my foot as well. Oh. Uh, Let's go inside. In case you didn't realize, what you just witnessed was 324 kilograms of solid ice blocks collapsing. But not just collapsing, collapsing onto my head. Now, I just want to start by saying this is not... Well, I just want to start by saying that you probably have eternal brain damage. A joke. This is not a skit. This is 100% genuine. That's Morse code. Get it? Morse code. Morse code. This is Morse code. Oh, this is a skit. Do not take it seriously. Now, as I'm sure you guys know, my challenges are usually fun. I never really have any severe consequences. Hey, 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 what about the thing that you see that own, own your, at your own, own house? Or 24 hours, oh, that, that, that had consequences. A lot of the things I say is just me being dramatic. I even said this at the start of the video. And if one of these 27 kilogram ice blocks falls and lands on my head, I think we all know what would happen. Guys, to be completely- Well, if one of them landed on your head, you thought you were gonna die, but 300 of them landed, like 300 kilograms of them land on your head. And you look dead. And sick. To be honest, when I said that, I was just being over dramatic. I didn't think it was actually gonna happen. Now, at this point in the video, I was in complete and utter shock. I had so much adrenaline, I literally couldn't feel a thing. Even after almost 300 kilograms of ice fell directly onto my head. But as the adrenaline started to go and the pain started to get more and more severe, I realized I had no other choice. I had to go to the hospital. Yeah. Oh my god, your brain is probably banner smashed in. You you've got eternal brain damage. You have to go to the hospital. I know, I know. It's hard to think that you have to go to the hospital after almost dying. How many ads are popping up in this video? I need to keep on clicking. Come on, mate. We're almost there. Let's get you checked out. Guys, we've just arrived at the hospital. Pain is getting really 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 bad my head is starting to get really wuzzy and it really really hurts on my left foot the ice obviously landed there as well as my head this was a really bad idea come on Guys, I'm in hospital at the minute, just waiting to see the doctor. I'm really hoping everything's going to be okay. I think it's my turn now to see the doctor. Wish me luck, guys. I'm going to need it.
Guys, it's been about two hours since Morgan went to see the doctor. I'm really, really worried. I feel so guilty. I'm really, really worried. My son theoretically got a hit on the head. And now he's walking around flying. He's just acting. He went into the doctor's office. I do all the to I shouldn't have let him do this challenge. Oh, this is awful. I've never felt so bad. If anything's happened to him, I won't be able to live with myself. Um, what are we? You can't cry on cue, I'm sorry. I just can't. I'll never forgive myself. I just hope that he's okay. And nothing serious has happened to him. It's Morgan! I am actually a robot, Lord Barry no Morgan. Your son has died. Morgan, are you okay? What, what did they say? How are you feeling? Well, they said that there's really bad bruising from the ice blocks, mainly on my head and my left foot. They said that they're going to need to take very. What's going on about your bloody left foot? That's me. Various tests, and it's going to take hours, maybe even days. They're going to need to check my head. They're going to need to check my foot. They're going to need to take X-rays. They're going to need to check if I'm my mental state. They need to check mental state. I think you needed that before you got hit on the head with a nice block. It's okay. They've got to do all these tests on me just to check that I'm feeling okay and that nothing's broken. They said I might be concussed. They just said that I need to stay the night here in the hospital and basically just check that everything's okay. Guys, I may have failed the 24 hour challenge inside the ice house, but now I guess I'm doing a new 24 hour challenge inside the hospital. Oh my god, it's so hard. It's not like you can sleep in it and nothing will collapse on your head. God's sake. I just risked my life and almost lost it for a 24 hour challenge. And before I go back into that doctor's room and take some tests to find out if my bones are broken and if my head is okay, I just want to say, please subscribe and get me to 10 million subscribers. I just want to say, I might die, but before I die, I want to hit 4 million. Not 4 million, you already hit 4 million. I want to hit 10 million subscribers before I die. It will be my dream. Because no other YouTuber is willing to do what I'm willing to do. Well, um, Mr. Beast actually does real 24 hour challenge, so go to look at his channel. He does 24 hours and he, um, says he will know lots, and that's actually my favorite one. But Chris kind of messed it up because he, well, he kind of had a kid and stuff. Well, Anyway guys, I think that will be the end of the video. I hope that you, that you had an amazing time, a smashing time in, in watching this video. Hopefully, I'm not stupid as well. Remember, the unique Ruby! Asshole.